Hello everyone, welcome to some basic track and today I will talk about Zoom application. So uh, Zoom is a uh, kind of application that globally used for uh, meetings and video sharing or you know calling purpose. So uh, also it is used for you know uh, in corporate life. So let's see uh, how we can just use it and uh, how we can install, configure and how we can even configure SSO login. So let's see how we are just going to do it first of all we need to download uh, zoom so uh, zoom download you can just type in google uh, in browser just like this and uh, click on the not the first link that is the link is used for basically uh, application mobile android applications so i'm not going to click on that you can click on this link and uh, i will share this link into video description also and click to download once it is download, we will go for further installation and configuration part. It will take around uh, 16 to 17 seconds. Let's wait. In between, uh, if you like the video, kindly do subscribe and uh, share. So, and also if you want any specific videos, so you can just comment me and uh, you can just try to ping me so I can do it also. let's click on it to install it is in a slicing stage uh, it doesn't take much time to install so yes the successful installation is done and uh, you can see two options here join meeting so if you want to join a meeting directly you can just click to join here and uh, it is require your meeting id and uh, further password also and uh, you can choose your name just like uh, my name is Sirvant Kumar so i'm just choosing it and uh, once i will put id and password i will able to log in and don't connect to audio turn off my video so you can pre uh, just click on this so once you join it will not going to start your mic or video so i'm going to back i'm going to sign in and uh, you can see here the four options to log in your zoom even you can try to log in with your uh, personal email id and uh, once you click to sign up it will ask you the email id and uh, further password and then configuration password so uh, i will talk about the all parts which is requiring here just like a facebook so if you have id you can just click on it and uh, it will go for your zoom uh, web browser and here you can just need to provide your facebook id for login and if you have google id uh, almost of us we have a google id so we just only need to click on this link and uh, it will ask you to provide your id and apple id is the also similar one but sso is a different thing that uh, let me explain you so basically uh, if you're uh, going to use your company email id just like a microsoft.com uh, srimanthkumar.microsoft.com so this is a kind of my email id and uh, it is attached with the domain name uh, if i just say uh sri uh, at the rate kumar kumar at the rate microsoft dot com so uh, this is the kind of uh, a very a uh, demo purpose you can uh, just take it as a demo so this is the kind of uh, email id that we can just use to uh, login with our zoom so i'm not providing very similar one here uh, first we need to provide microsoft dot com this is the domain name of Microsoft first we need to provide our company domain and then we will go further else you don't know your company domain you just need to click on this link and here you just only need to provide your business email ID that would be your company email ID and once you click to here and provide it will ask you your password and uh, login process once you done you will use your single sign-on process that would uh, very easy and you will see your all calendar uh, attached all things so you don't need to worry about uh, 
how many meetings are scheduled for you uh, you don't need to check your outlook you will see here all of meetings and all that so just use it to this feature and uh, enjoy and uh, if you like the video do subscribe comment and share thanks for watching have a nice day